Nothing normal about J.J. Watt's tweet from earlier today. And I don't know if he's trolling us, if he's having fun, if he's sending messages, subliminal messages, like when we used to get a record, kids. You know what a record is? Google it. I'm sure they're out there again now. They've got the record <laughs> players. You spin it backward and you get hidden messages about who killed John Lennon or Paul McCartney or whoever it was. We know who killed John Lennon. It was Paul McCartney. Sorry, I got my dead Beatles wrong. But uh, Paul McCartney's not dead, or at least they say he's not. J.J. Watt, mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. That was his seven-word tweet earlier today that has sparked all sorts of speculation, most of which tongue-in-cheek, I think. Mitochondria is the same number of letters as the Buffalo Bills, so it means he's going to Buffalo. The Mitochondria Research Center is located in Buffalo. J.J. to the Bills. I've seen arguments like, there's a C in mitochondria. It means he's going to Cleveland. It, it's, it's, you could make a case for almost any team based upon that tweet. I don't know what he's trying to prove, and I think he's just kind of messing with us, and I kind of like it, Shireen. I love it, Mike. He's trolling us, isn't he? And, you know, he responded a couple days ago to a card. It was obviously a Cardinals fan. I think the Twitter handle was something like Kyler to DeAndre or something like that that tweeted to J.J. Watt, and he actually answered it and said, you're going to have to give me a minute. It takes me forever to order from DoorDash. It takes me like an hour to order from DoorDash. So, you know, as you've said, Mike, that teams want to know what the cap is before they know how much they're willing to pay J.J. Watt, I think that's where he is. I think that's why he doesn't have a team, uh, because these teams are still waiting to figure out what that final cap number is going to be and how much they can commit to J.J. Watt. Maybe he doesn't get as much as he thinks he's going to get, Mike. Or maybe he gives some team a discount that he really wants to go to. If he wants to win a Super Bowl, there are plenty of teams out there that are interested in J.J. Watt, and J.J. Watt will have his choice of, of several of those teams, Mike, as we've heard. The Titans are the only, only ones who've publicly admitted that they have interest in J.J. Watt, but we've heard all the other teams out there who, who reportedly have interest in J.J. Watt, and there's a number of them that he can pick to go to, and he'll help them. I think the bottom line is no one is going to sign J.J. Watt until they know what the salary cap yeah. is. And I think we are a week at least away from knowing the cap. I'd like to think we'll know what it is before March 10 when the window closes on application of the franchise tag because it's hard to know what you're committing to if you don't know what the cap is. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.